YouTube. I'm back with another video. Um, this is week five pickums. I'm showing you guys my week four right now. This was like the fucking like worst week ever. So, yeah, there was a lot of upsets this week. Um, you just I'm just showing you going through it. Yeah, it was tough this week. A lot of unexpected teams like Panthers, Buccaneers. I mean, I chose this as an upset. Uh, I chose this. Mm. Yeah, some of these teams, I just, I just, I'm just stupid. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, let's just go to week five picks. Just pick these teams. Um, Rams at Seattle. Who do I think is going to win? Who I think is going to win? I think the Rams are going to win. But who I want to win are the Seahawks. Um, because I feel like the Rams are a bigger threat to us than the Seahawks. I think we have Seattle's number now. With our new defense and stuff like that. Uh, we beat them last year with like Nick Mullins. But I think the Rams are, have our number. So if the Seahawks could beat the Rams, that would be lovely. Next we got the Atlanta Falcons at Houston Texans. Um, Atlanta has been looking very bad. I don't know what happened. Like, Like you guys came out week one, got dominated by the Vikings. Then you guys <clears throat> look like hella good against the the Eagles. I mean, not hella good because Matt Ryan still like struggled, but you guys beat a good ass team in the Eagles who beat the Packers. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like who are you guys? But um, the Texans they lost to the Panthers. I mean that uh. That old line is ass, bro. That's probably like the worst old line in the whole league. They're just letting like Watson get killed. If they keep this shit up, this dude might retire just like Andrew Luck. But I think because at home, I'm gonna choose the Texans. <clears throat> okay, um, Bills at Tennessee. Um, I'm hearing that, uh, Josh Allen might not play. Oh, fuck. What just happened? Okay. Um, I don't know what just happened. Uh, okay. Let's go back home. Okay. I'm hearing that Josh Allen might not play. Um, and I think Tennessee. Because Tennessee beat the Vikings. Tennessee the same thing. Like, I mean, not the Vikings. They, they beat the uh, Falcons. Tennessee came out week one, dominated the Browns. Came out week two, looked like shit. Came out week three, I think they looked like shit again or something like that. Yeah, they looked like shit again. And then came out week four and looked hella good. Like, I don't get it. But you know what? I'm going to choose the Texans. I'm gonna, oh, my God. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to choose the Titans because I don't think Josh Allen's going to play in Matt Berkeley, I don't... Yeah, he's not going to win. The only way the Bills win this game is by defense. All right, the Bears at Oakland. I'm going to choose the Bears, even though Trubisky's not playing. It's just that that Bears defense can win you a game on its own. It's just... Yeah, I don't see the Raiders offense doing anything on the Bears. Uh, Cardinals at the Bengals. <sighs> Cardinals, Bengals. Um, it's a one o'clock game. This is a ten a.m. game. Ooh. Do the Bengals get their first win, or do the Cardinals get their first win? This is funny. So we can have another team. Get their first win. I'm gonna go with uh Bengals look like shit today. 
By the way, I'm doing this on Monday right after the game. Or not right after. Look at this shit. It's damn near 1 o'clock almost. But, uh, Bengals look like shit today. Um, I think Arizona gets his first one. Ooh, I'm having a gut feeling that Bengals might shock, but still. Alright, Vikings at New York. Um, yeah, come on, man. I don't see the Vikings losing this game. Dude, what's going on? Man, shut your dumb ass up. Oh my god, I'm getting sold. Um, like I said, I don't see the Vikings losing back to back games. Uh, that's why I have the Vikings winning. And low key, they were, uh, the John, fucking what's his name? Was struggling against <clears throat> the Rest Kings. Daniel Jones was struggling. He threw two picks. So people are not even talking about that. But he threw two picks. He was not even looking that good. Yeah, come on, man. Come on, man. This is a no brainer. Buccaneers at the Saints. Now, the Bucks always play the Saints good, man. I think the Bucks shocked the world. Not shocked the world. But they shock people. And they get this win. I really believe so. I think the Bucks get out Teddy Bridgewater with Shaq, Shaquille Barrett, who's dominating the league right now. The Bucks aren't a bad team, man. They got the they got great offense. They were number one offense twenty eighteen. Like, I just don't get why people just flip. I don't know. Oh well. All right, New York at Eagles. I'm hearing that San Donald's not gonna play, so Eagles get a free victory. Ah, Ravens at Pittsburgh. I don't know. Yeah, Ravens going to win that one. It's just, they have a better team. Like, come on, man. Jacksonville at Carolina. Now, this is very funny because this is two backup quarterbacks who are undefeated in their two starts. Gardner Minshew and Kyle Allen. Um. Damn, I really don't, bro. This is literally a toss up, bro. Because it's like they both have like good defense. I think. Okay. Let me put this in perspective. I think. I think. I'm going to go with, oh my god, dude, I'm done with this shit, bro, like, like, this shit's really getting on my nerves, bro, uh, what was I talking about, oh, you got Garner Minshew and shit, I think I'm going to go with the Panthers on that one, because I think their, be their running back is better, their receiving core is better, um, their defense, I feel like, is underrated. So, yeah. The, by the way, Panthers loot the league in sacks, so yeah. I'm going to go with the Chargers on this one. The Broncos are not looking good. And I predicted they were going to go like 4-12. and 12. People called me dumb and shit. I already knew it. All right, the Packers at Dallas. Um, I'm hearing that Devontae Adams is not going to play. And that won't matter because Aaron Rodgers does Aaron Rodgers things against the Cowboys. He's going to beat their ass. I think uh, the Chiefs are going to dominate this game. The Colts defense looked horrible against the Raiders. Then the game we've all been waiting for. Damn, it's literally 50-50. Hold up. Is it 50-50? I can't even tell. Wait, is that? I don't know. It's literally 50 50. Now, my friend, San Francisco 49ers against the Cleveland Browns. Listen, even though I'm a Niners fan, 
And I really, 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 really want us to win this game. I really feel like this is going to be our first L. And this is going to be, like, a beneficial thing for us so that we can stay humble and shit. And, like, like just get the first L out the way. Even though it's, pro like, you don't want to... You don't want to lose any game, right? But if you're going to lose a game, lose it in the fucking regular season or some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? And lose it to, like, a, a, a good team. Because if you lose it to a bad team, that's, like, a heartbreaker. So if you're going to lose a game, lose it in the regular season. Don't lose that shit in the playoffs. You got to know how an L feels. Bro, I'm done with this shit, bro. Oh, my God. I'm not even going to do this shit. I'm going to do this shit later. You got to know how an L feels. So, with this game, I'm going to go with the Browns. But I'm going to say they beat us by, like, a field goal. I'm going to say 27. 24. That's it, man. That's the picks. People are going to be surprised. But still, man, I I really see that shit, like, I'm like a sidekick, no cap. <laughs> Alright, well, this is my week five picks, and see y'all niggas next week. I'm doing this shit every week, bro. I'm consistent.